rain Just singing in the rain What a glorious feeling I'm happy again Max Clayton is living his dream. So dark up above The sun's in my heart And I'm ready for love It's an incredible production with an incredible cast. I can't emphasize that enough. And uh, it's just really, I don't want it to end. <laughs> Max Clayton's performance as Don Lockwood in Tonight, Singing in the Rain drew ovations and accolades every night during its four week run at the Agunquit Playhouse. The California dew is a little heavier than usual tonight. Really? From where I stand, the sun is shining all over the place. For Max, playing a role made famous by actor and dancer Gene Kelly is especially poignant. It's my favorite movie, and um, it's a dream. It's a dream. Doing the, the rain sequence is, um, <laughs> oh, it feels so good. It feels so good. And I have just loved being back in New England and bringing joy to people every day. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. How are you? Nice and easy. Gene Kelly is, was definitely my idol growing up. I had posters of his films on my walls, and he was the person that sort of proved to me that you can be masculine and dance. You can show emotion and dance, and it's okay, and you can have fun, and you can change lives. That, growing, having him growing up was everything. And there's now, he's, he paved the way. He paved the way. It's a beast of a role. I'm off stage at maybe two scenes. And when I'm not on stage, I'm drenched. Not by the water, not by the, the rain, but by the sweat and the costumes and the lighting. And I'm in my dressing room, <laughs> toweling off, chugging water changing shoes, running back on. We met with Max on set at the Agunquit Playhouse. Lucky for us, at the time, the set was dry. During the performance, not so much. The production uses 300 gallons of water every night. We have little divots in the set that kind of collect water to create a puddle that I can really splash and jump and mm -hmm. get them wet. And, you know, at the end of the, yeah, the end of the act, the, the very famous lamppost, um, I get to just jump up and just get poured on, and it's a dream every day. I laugh. The end of the act one is just sort of me honestly laughing and taking it in. It's so special and fun. Ah, uh, the lamppost. Remember that legendary scene from the 1952 MGM classic film? Gene Kelly jumping on the lamppost while singing the title song. So what does that feel like? Max gives me a hand so I can see for myself, minus the water. Ready? Yeah. There you go. Hang out. Arm here, yes. Okay. Look up and let the rain fall. Yeah. Oh, awesome. <laughs> it's the best. Max's role at a Agunquit is fresh from his Broadway stint in the production of The Music Man at the Winter Garden Theater in New York City. Max was the understudy, or standby, for Hugh Jackman in the role of Harold Hill. Max stepped into that role at the last minute when Jackman came down with COVID in June of 2022. Max learned he was to play the lead when he was back home in Manchester. His mother, Jane Clayton, was celebrating her retirement from the Manchester school system. And Max surprised her at her retirement party. We were having a great time and my phone is ringing and ringing and ringing. And I'm about to make a speech. And it's my producer of, of Music Man. She's like, Max, where are you? And I was like, uh, actually, in New Hampshire, I'm at home. She's like, well, Hugh has COVID, and you're going on. So you've witnessed a Broadway miracle. Because <laughs> our very own Max Clayton, who has been part of this company and this production for over three years, it was his very first night leading the band. 
Max says lead actor Sutton Foster was instrumental in helping him on his first night, and he credits Hugh with teaching him so much. Thank you. We are so grateful to you. I'll go to the footbridge with you anytime. The best advice she said to me was, don't apologize for being Max Clayton tonight. And that was so comforting because when you're covering an A-list celebrity like Hugh Jackman and people travel from all over the world, pay a lot of money to see their idol. And then I walk on stage. It's my job to take care of them. He's like a friend for life. I owe him so much. He taught me so much. He taught me how to lead a company. Um, he taught me the importance of spontaneity and the importance of listening.